the cards today are the sun, the death card, the high priestess. Okay, so the sun and the death card. This is the light and the shadow. The death card is connected to Scorpio. And Scorpio, the sun moves into Scorpio today. So we're feeling a shift in energy. So the sun has moved from Libra, which is an earth sign, into the water sign, the fixed water sign of Scorpio. A time for deep transformational healing, allowing the healing waters of the cosmos to cleanse us of any dense energies to help us to heal from those karmic relationships that we keep stepping into that always end up the same so we're shifting from that now we are purging that we are bringing ourselves into alignment with the authenticity of who we are we have the high priestess reminding us to go within to observe our inner environment to connect to the mystic within us the high priestess within us she always guides us inwards so we're delving deep into our emotions into any discomfort that we have been holding within our bodies the high priestess is telling us that's where the magic is to go in there and alchemize those emotions the ace of cups as we alchemize those old emotions to do with relationships because we are just moving from the sun in libra libra uh, is connected to the south nodes that we have been going through that past life healing the karmic cycles time of really letting go of healing our I am wound so that we can align and draw in relationships that are on the same wavelength as we are so this is a magical a mystical time this is the time of the witch this is the season of the witch to use our energies to use our energies to feel positive energy within and allow that to build and build within every cell of our bodies until we start to resonate it through us into our energy fields and focusing on staying in that beautiful alignment why this energy purges anything that is not of that it's important during this time of such chaos in the outside world to tend to our inner environment to not get entangled in the outside world we have the page of wands this is good news coming in some good news to do with love some message coming through but to receive this it's about knowing that we're worth it knowing that whoever has us in their life is lucky we've gone through a time of really cleansing away our codependency on others relying on someone else to make us happy 
feeling that we are there to look after everyone else and in doing so sacrifice ourselves we've gone through a massive conscious shift that we are aligning now to our authenticity and to the truth of who we are being open and allowing ourselves to be loved and loving with an open heart so the page brings us a message a beautiful message and I'm feeling this is a message about romance about love a deeper love that is filled with peace that is respectful that is uplifting that brings into our lives joy because we found all those attributes within ourselves and we have connected and we have attuned to those beautiful frequencies of love, of joy, of upliftment and during this time with the sun in Scorpio, Pluto rules Scorpio and Pluto is finishing and wrapping up its final degrees in Capricorn and once Pluto leaves Capricorn it won't visit Capricorn again for another 250 years so this is major generational shifts we're moving through moving through these shifts alchemizing those ancestral wounds alchemizing the wounds of our past lives alchemizing our witch wound we are in the season of the witch being open and authentic about our spiritual gifts and this season brings in and activates our spiritual gifts activates our psychic gifts so as, we're, as we are releasing the old, we are allowing our spiritual gifts to come online, to start to resonate through us. We're not hiding any longer. We're shining a light. This is a powerful time to anchor light to stay focused on love and peace regardless of what is occurring in the outside world stay aligned stay focused connect with your inner mystic and allow that magical energy to flow through from you into your outside world creating miracles wherever you go I'm sending you so much love and healing to anyone who needs it.